are you wasting a lot of time and resources just doing a uh, typical onboarding, like copy and pasting things? If that's you, this video is for you. Watch till the end and you'll have a better idea of how you can actually do this automatically. My name is Siavash and I'm a high level expert, the first Australian to be a high level expert. And also I do a lot of uh, partnership with Zapier, make probably loads of automation. So that's what I do for a living. And in this quick video, I'm going to show you how you can actually set up a simple automation process using a uh, high level. This is just the basic, you can build upon this. We have a lot more complex uh, uh, automatic onboarding, which I'm not going to obviously show in this video. But anyway, this is going to give you a good starting point. So what is happening in here is we have a simple uh, order form that there's two product on that, that the user can select between those two products. And based on that, we do a simple routing to see which product that uh, they purchased. Once we, uh, once we figure that out, then they're gonna receive specific onboarding uh, forms based on that product. And we also assign them to a specific uh, account manager. Uh, just to give you a little bit of uh, look into the future, the things that you can do, what we do is in our own agency or like helping out other agencies, like we're setting up Airtable, we're setting up uh, uh, Click, up uh, or Monday, depending on what uh, product management uh, software they're using. Uh, we set up in a Slack for uh, that specific client with the account manager, send the invitation and everything automatically happens. All right, so the process is very simple. So we have a, a two-way, uh, two-step order checkout. I'm not gonna go through every single step. So you fill this up and basically you update the uh, information and stuff. Um, I've already done that and we have two persons here, fake persons, that one of them went to product one and one of them went to product two. Okay, now let's go ahead and check the product two at the top. Now this person went through the product two, they haven't done anything yet and they got the email for onboarding two. Now just remember the name, the name is Adam Abbasalipur and if they click on this, fill out this form, see what happens. So as you can see, the full name and the email address automatically gets filled out. So whatever information you have taken on the, what you call like the purchase form, you can inject it in here. And all you need to do is go ahead and put their website and say, hey, I want to do Google Ads. And then click on submit. Now, this was a very, very simple onboarding for obviously you might have a lot of other things that you ask, uh, custom values and those kind of things that you automatically set up as soon as they uh, fill it up. Uh, other things that you can think of is if uh, within a specific uh, time span, if they don't fill it up, you have your people following up with them automatically. So that was form one and now let's, uh, form two, now let's go and look at the person that actually purchased the, uh, product one and let's click on that. Now, if you look the name and email address updated uh, accordingly to that person, so this is how they're gonna receive it as well. This is onboarding one, same thing. Let's say they're gonna choose this and they're gonna choose this one and click on submit. And again, these are the things that can automatically get updated. So if we go back to the previous person, you'll see that the contact information that they provided got updated, they have the website, they have the service that they chose, and if we go to the other one, and we expand this one, we got the product and services that they've chosen as well. So this was just to give you a taste of what is possible to make this happen, but if you have any specific question or any specific things that you want to make sure that you can automate with uh, your onboarding, just, just hit me up and uh, let me know and I'm more than happy to help you out. But that was it. Uh, let me know if you have any questions and uh, please don't forget to share, subscribe. If it's you from TikTok, just pin it. And if you want to hire us or work with us, uh, you can check out our link in the bio. And yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.